What's up, Blissful Beauties? So today we're going to be doing this Pennywise makeup look. Am I a makeup artist? No, ma'am. Uh, and, and watch this video. Please be sure to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you are notified when I upload. So. Let's get on to the video. So right here I'm just going to pick up my hair because it's in the way. And then I'm going to go in with my Maybelline Master Conceal in light 20. And I'm just going to put like an even coat like on my eyelid. After that I will then go in with a light pink. No, it's like a purplish pink color. And a Morphe 35B palette. And I'm just going to put that in my crease. Once I do that, I then go in with a hot pink. And I want to say it's in bikini from last time. But, um, yeah. I'm just going to go and I'm going to put that on my lid. And it's going to give it like, um, like a really vibrant look to it. I'm just going to blend those in together. Once I am done with that color, I'm going to do like this purple shade and I'm going to blend that in right underneath those pinks and I'm going to switch to a different area because I had to cut some footage. So I'm going back in with that concealer and I'm just carving out my cut. Once I'm done doing that, I'm going to go in with this white and I'm going to then go in with this white. I then go in with this purple color at the end and I'm just blending it out. I have this H2O proof um, wet and wild eyeliner and I'm just putting that on. Once I'm done doing that, I go in with this NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Milk. And I just put it in the inner corners. I then go in with my Jaclyn Hill palette with this shimmer color. And I just put it in the corners of my eye. Now I'm using my Porefessional um, Primer by Benefit. And I'm just rubbing that all in. And guys, I'm growing up. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. But I did go in and got... Um, a foundation by Tarte and I got it in the color fair light neutral so I'm just going ahead and I am blending that all in and I also ended up getting a concealer guys it's also by Tarte and it is in fair neutral and you'll see me use that right now once I put my concealer on, I then go and use my Smashbox Studio Skin Shaping Foundation. And we are just going to blend that right in. And so, guys... Like I said, I am not a makeup artist. I just do this stuff for fun and um, it works for me. So now I'm using my Wet n Wild Photo Focus Translucent Powder. And I don't know why I don't have footage of it, but I'm wiping it away now. I'm using that um, Wet n Wild H2O Waterproof Eyeliner again. And I'm just going in and making like a cat eye look in the inner corners of my eye. I do it to my bottom lash line as well, giving it that effect. And I am using those same pink colors that we used before and that's what I ended up putting underneath my eye. Then I went in with that purple and now I am using my Better Than Sex Mascara. Now it's time for the Pennywise tutorial. So I'm using my NYX Jumbo Pencil in Milk. And I'm just carving out what I think Pennywise's face would look like. And 
I'm not perfect guys, but <laughs> this is me and I'm using that bright pink, that hot pink color and I'm just putting it on um, where I have put the pencil. I also go back in with that purple um, in a little bit and I put it on the corners of my mouth and at the very tip where my eyebrow is. And you're going to do the same thing for the other side as well. And. You really don't have to be perfect about it. Um, I mean, it wasn't an easy tutorial, honestly. It's it's really not. Um, but you'll see me in a little bit. I use my flat brush and I just carve out um, those white areas and it just gives it like a defined look. It kind of helped me out a lot just leaving a lot of that white area alone just so that I could use it <laughs> to just clean it up. You'll see me. See? Look. Even Brie makes mistakes. <laughs> but yeah, it's really repetitive. I try to use the same colors over and over again. That way, you know, you're not jumping from like palette to palette. I didn't have shimmers in the Morphe 35B palette, so that's why you'll see me using the Jaclyn Hill palette. And um, I, I, I honestly, I think I only used it like in two spots of this makeup look. Just like in the corner of my eye, and then you'll see me use it on the tip of my nose. So look guys, we're going back in with that jumbo eye pencil and milk and we're just putting that on the nose and look, what did I say? That same pink color. We're going to put that and we're just going to dab it on the nose. After that, we're going to just carve around it with that purple and once you do that, you're going to get that same brush that you just used and just blend it out. You don't want a harsh purple line. Once you do that, we go in with this shimmer from the Jaclyn Hill palette and we just put it on the tip of our nose. I went ahead and put my lashes on and these are Kiss lashes, like always. And this is my Milani um, lipstick in, in Fancy. And I really like these lipsticks. Um, I swear I have them in every color. <laughs> But once we do that, we're going to get that same purple and we're just going to carve out like the outer lip, I guess. Just line the lip on the inner corners, really. <laughs> That's what I meant to say with that purple. Now we are all done. How do you like this look, guys? Do you like it? Yes or no? I'm really digging it. I like it a lot. Look at me looking all cute and whatnot. Mrs. Pennywise. Okay guys, so this is the finished product. Um would I say it was easy? No, I wouldn't. I would not say it was easy at all. Um let me give you an example of what happened so when I was filming my um, Pennywise tutorial first part of the video um, you'll see me doing my eyeshadow and honestly I love the way my eyeshadow had came out that time it was so perfect and everything and when it came down to it and I was finally done like which what when I thought I was done um, with that part of the video, I ended up messing up because 
my dumb self wasn't even filming my actual eye and that's why you'll see me like duck down a lot um because i didn't know that i wasn't getting my eye i was thinking the whole time that i was actually filming and i wasn't so a lot of parts had got cut out but i did my best to try and like do it all over again now the second time that i started filming the video um i was on the floor and i was doing um i was trying to do it um to where I would see myself again. Now, I ended up getting like my eye part then again, but my eyeshadow didn't really come out the exact same way that I had did it before. I had taken off everything, okay? Because I had got so upset and I was like, no, like I'm not gonna film that. Like I'm not gonna, I mean, I'm not gonna show that, right? I ended up showing it to you because the second film that I did was horrible. I didn't like the way the eyeshadow came out and I think I was just brushing it and before I had more time than what I did the second time because I was kind of like on a on a time limit from like me starting to me going to get a mirror so I was just like you know what maybe it's just not meant for me to do but I said you know what I'm gonna give it one more try so for the third time when I was filming I um the third time I was filming I just went ahead and I was like you know what I'm just gonna hurry up do my little blending because I know in the first video I at least got the the colors in right so I was like I'm just gonna use that and then I'm gonna just start where I'm um carving out my my cut so that's where that's why like you'll see in my video like I'm jumping from here to there and I'm sorry guys but I wanted to show you this and this is my pink Pennywise tutorial and I hope that y'all like it thanks guys thanks for watching bye